In this Top Dog training video, you're going to learn how to transfer a call. There's three types of call transfers that you can do. You can transfer a caller blind or attended or direct to a user's voicemail. And during this demonstration, I have labeled each of these phones so you can see whose phone it is. So Johnny is back here. He's outside the company and he's calling in to mine and Susie's company. We work together. He's going to call me at Randy at this one. I'm going to pick up the phone. He's going to want to talk to Susie over here at extension 556. So for this first demonstration, we're going to see how to transfer a call blind. By blind, I mean when I transfer the call to Susie, I will not speak to her. When she picks up the phone, it will be Johnny. Okay? I answer the phone. Hello, ABC Widgets. Yes, this is Johnny. Can I speak with Susie, please? Sure, Johnny. Hold on a second. I'm going to hit the transfer button. I'm going to enter in Susie. It says transfer to. So I'm going to enter in Susie. And then I'm going to hit B, transfer. Your call is being transferred. Hello, Susie. All right. See how easy that was. Okay, now we're going to transfer attended. Attended means before I transfer the call, before I transfer Johnny over to Susie, I'm going to talk to Susie and see if, to let her know who's calling and if she wants to talk to him. Okay, so call comes in. I answer. Oh, hey, Johnny, hold on a second. Let me see if Susie's available. Now I'm going to hit transfer. Transfer to, so I'm going to enter in Susie. I'm going to hit, I'm not going to hit this one, the B send. I'm going to hit send right here. I want to talk to her. She picks up the phone. I say, hi, Susie. I got Johnny on the line. Would you like to speak with him? See, she says, sure. So now I finish the transfer by hitting this transfer button one more time right here. And now Susie says, hello. Hey, Johnny. Okay. That's how you transfer a call attended. The third type of call transfer that you can do is transferring a caller direct to a user's voicemail, usually because you know they're away from their desk. So in this case, we're going to have Johnny call Susie. Susie's going to pick up the phone, and then she's going to transfer direct to my voicemail because I have it set up right now. So Johnny calls. Susie picks up the phone, says, ABC Widgets, how may I help you? Johnny says, can I speak with Randy, please? It's Johnny. Susie says, you know, Johnny, Randy's away from his desk right now. Would you like his voicemail? Sure, that'd be great. Okay, hold on one moment. Now Susie hits transfer, and she's going to enter a 7 before she enters in my extension. So my extension is 555, so she's going to enter the 7 first, and then 555, and then she's going to hit the B transfer. Hi, you've reached Randy Banker here. I am away from my desk right now. Please leave your name and number in a brief message, and I will give you a call when I... And that's how you transfer a caller directly to a user's voicemail. Okay, in this video, we've learned the three ways to transfer a call, blind, attended, and direct to a user's voicemail. I'll see you in the next video.